groceries. Where are we right now? We are now at the Calle Cristolago and well, this is the famous street here in Vigan City. Um, all over the Philippines, this is one of the cities that you must visit when you talk of history, you talk of culture, you talk of heritage. Now, why is this street the most popular in Vigan? Yeah, this street is uh, very popular in Vigan because this street has the most number of all the houses of all structures. And this structure basically gives you an idea of how the city did when it started. So I'm here with Mika from Senorita Zanna, a fellow travel blogger here in the Philippines. So Mika, you're actually from the Philippines. Yes, I am. So what is one thing you would want everyone to know about the Philippines? Well, the Philippines is quite different from other Southeast Asian countries. Like, um, because of the influence of the Spaniards, the Americans, the Japanese, and the Japanese. It's a very interesting country because uh, we have something to offer, different <laughs> different regions have something to offer. What's your favorite dish that every traveler here has to try? Ah, can I pick three? <laughs> you can pick three. Okay, first one is of course the adobo. Adobo. Which is our, uh, I'm not sure if it's official but it's our national dish. Okay. And then there's uh, bulalo. Bulalo. Yeah, it's okay. my favorite. But there are different types of bulalo also for region. Okay. And then sinigang. Which sinigang. Yes. Okay. Sinigang that you can cook it with shrimp, uh, fish, or pork. So here we are in Vigan. What are we eating? Okay, so um, this is isaw or chicken in the steam. And this is the vegan version of empanada. Empanada. Yes. So this is kind of a nod to the Spanish influences here yes. in the Philippines, right? Yes. The empanada. And then this is okoy. I think we got this from the Chinese. Okoy. So this is like a shrimp like fritter. Yeah. Kind of. Yes. And you said you put some vinegar on it. Okay. Alright. So of these three, which one is your favorite? Uh, yes, it's still the empanada, but uh, uh, isao is uh, typical in the Philippines. Like it, it's a street food in the Philippines. Isao. All right. Well, cheers. <laughs> so we're coming up on Jollibee, which is the Filipino version of McDonald's. It's a big deal here, and that's why this is on the itinerary. Uh, it has the cutest little mascot you'll ever see, and their Chicken Joy sandwich is supposed to be amazing. There's a lot of pride here in the Philippines, and so they have a lot of pride in this main competitor to McDonald's. And actually, this is a chain, and there's one evidently in New Jersey. This is insane. I have never seen any sort of fountain show like this. So every single night during the week, a 30 minute fountain show takes place right here. And set to music, and it's called the, it's known as the Dancing Fountain here in Vigan. 